All right, in looking at uh, this problem, you have an inscribed angle of 50 plus x, and you have an intercepted arc of 5x minus 57. So what is the relationship between an inscribed angle and an intercepted arc? Um, the angle. So the inscribed angle, 50 plus x, is equals half of 1 half times the intercepted arc, 5x minus 57. Okay. Now, you can also think of this in the following way. What does the intercepted arc equal? Intercepted arc is equal to twice the inscribed angle. Okay, either of these will work. It winds up being the same calculation because you can either distribute your one half through or you can multiply both sides by two. My suggestion would be if you distribute through and you get fractions, okay, I would if you start with a fraction and distribute through to get fractions, I would work the other direction. I just multiply everything on both sides of this equation by 2. So that's going to give me 50 times 2 plus x times 2. And then here, just need to be careful, the 1 half is going to cancel with that 2 and the whole expression 5x minus 57 will stay as it is. The common misconception is to try to distribute this multiplication through here, but you don't need to. Uh, you only distribute through a sum. This is actually a product, one-half times this quantity. So when you multiply, it's only going to multiply by the half. So that would lead you to the same equation that you would have gotten here. And then just solve through. You can either use your calculator to solve for x, uh, or if you work through by hand, subtract the 2x from both sides. It leaves you 3x. Add 57 to both sides. That gives you 157, divide by 3, and so that winds up being your solution for x in that case.